Coronation Street fans have seen Stephen Reed claim the lives of three Weatherfield residents, could a fourth be on the cards? Coronation Street actor Todd Boyce has teased who could be the next person to die at the hands of killer Stephen Reed. Last year, the Canadian businessman accidentally murdered Leo Tompkins when he pushed him off the top of the Underworld factory. Not long after he killed his dad Teddy Tompkins who came looking for his son and Rufus Donahue who was blackmailing him for money. Although he tried to take the life of a fourth person when he plotted to kill fiancé Elaine Jones, he was unsuccessful when his lies were exposed and she moved away. However, as her son Tim Metcalf remains suspicious of Stephen, he may be playing with fire. Speaking about Stephen and Tim's dynamic, the ITV soap star told The Mirror, he sees Tim as an annoyance, but Tim has lulled Stephen into a bit of a false sense of security. Stephen's arrogance has led him to underestimate Tim. What Tim is doing is keeping his enemy close by allowing him to stay living in the flat. The actor admitted he enjoys playing scenes with Joe as there's a lot of tension going on between the two men. Although he confessed Stephen doesn't intend to hurt Tim, there's no love lost between them. He added, Tim is kind of putting himself in the most dangerous place by delving a bit too much into Stephen's life. Other people who have been in this place where Tim is are no longer with us. Tim is walking a fine line. I don't see anyone else on the horizon in terms of who could be killed, we're not that far ahead so they could surprise me at any time. In recent scenes, one mysterious figure watched as Stephen dropped the tie pin that linked him to Rufus' murder down the drain. Is it possible the person in question is Tim and he's finally rumbled Stephen once and for all? Earlier this year, the two actors were spotted filming at the canal where Stephen had dumped Teddy's body after killing him. Unaware that he's being followed, Tim could be able to discover just how evil the businessman really is.